so winter is well and truly here in the UK and I'm freezing my nips off like 99% of the time when I'm outside. So I decided that it was time to move on from my autumn capture wardrobe and move into my winter capture wardrobe. If you haven't heard my whole capture wardrobe thing before then I'll link a video up here for you that goes more into the process of how I make one, although I'm a little bit less structured these days with it, but still the kind of core values of trying to keep everything very edited, very streamlined and not buying too many things throughout the season, kind of doing a bit of a big haul at the beginning of the season and just trying to stay clear of ASOS and various other online outlets for the rest of the season. Um, let me know if you'd like a video actually on how I process from like one season to another. I kind of go over it on Snapchat and like Instagram stories often but not in an actual video so give me a shout if you'd like to see that and I'll let you know. But today I thought I would show you my winter capsule wardrobe additions. I bought some things recently and I thought it was the perfect time to show you given that it's the whole Black Friday, Cyber Weekend, Cyber Monday shebang. There are loads of discounts going on so all of these bits are discounted at the moment. I think most of them are about 20% off, if not some are more, some are less. I will let you know all of the discounts that I currently know when I'm filming this video as we go. And also I will put everything in the description box below, all the discounts, all the promo codes, along with a couple of links for some of the items because I know that the Whistles jumpsuit that I'm gonna mention is sold out already. So if things are on other websites, I'll pop a link for all of those down below. But basically the description box is where it's at and I'm very happy with my purchases. There's a lot of faux fur going on, there's some over the knee boots from ASOS that are a complete bargain and of course there are some whistles bits but there's also a couple of things from my new favourite store to buy online which is and other stories, obsessed with a few bits that I picked up from there but I'm going to kick off with the ASOS things. So the good news is that ASOS has 20% off at the moment, I have a feeling it ends tomorrow although I'm not 100% sure and it's actually 30% off for US peeps on your asos.com or whatever which is amazing i will pop a link down below i'll pop the promotion code that you need down below but all of these bits i'm going to show you from asos so you can get 20 percent off of amazing and the first thing that i purchased was a pair of over the knee boots which cost me 55 pounds annoyingly but with the discount that they're currently running i think they're 44 pounds which i just think is such a blooming bargain because i've been after a pair of over the knee boots for probably like the last two seasons, the two winter seasons. I've wanted a pair for a really long time, but I didn't want to invest 600 pounds in the Stuart Weitzman Highland boots or something, because I didn't know if it was something I was gonna get a lot of wear out. So I tried a pair of Kurt Geiger ones. They were way too small for me. Picked these up from ASOS, kind of because I couldn't be bothered to order from Kurt Geiger again. Just a pair load of money for like next day delivery and everything. Saw these, these are literally exactly the same as the Kurt Geiger pair that I picked up and they were 150 quid. These are like under a third of the price and they're honestly incredible. I can't remember what they're called off the top of my head, but they're just suede over the knee boots. I'll insert a little cutaway fee here so you can see what they look like. Instead of having a tie at the back, they have a little pulley bit, which I think is really helpful. And actually it's the most practical way of keeping them up because then you're not having to like tie up a bow or anything like that. You can also just tuck this in if you don't want them to dangle out the back, but I quite like them dangling out the back. On me, they come up to just above the knee. It's worth noting that I'm five foot seven in case you're wondering how they would fit on you. And I find that they actually fit quite tight on the leg. They don't scrunch down or anything like that. I'm not constantly pulling them up, which is great. And I saw this zip on the side. Wasn't too keen on it online, but actually it's really handy because it means you can open them up. And if you're wearing jeans, you can give your jeans like a final tug down to make sure that they're not like bunching up anywhere. So it's very useful, very practical. And I just really like these. I like these a lot more than I thought I would and actually I've got a lot more use out of them than I thought I would even though I've only had them for about two weeks or so. I've been wearing them out in the evenings and yeah just really really impressed with these. Oh I am so excited about this. Now I kind of have a thing for like emerald green faux fur and I just go into websites and I put like green faux fur and see what comes up and it's like a little stole scarf thing that makes me feel like a queen or something <laughs> when I wear it but it is so soft and I just think this is a really nice finishing touch to an outfit because sometimes you've got coats that aren't really like fancy coats you know a coat a coat is there to keep you warm this will help keep you warm but also like jazz it up a little bit and I think it was 35 pounds so with the discount that's gonna be Oh shit. I got an A in Maths GCSE, I promise. 28 pounds, there you go, that is right. Oh god, that'd be really embarrassing if it's wrong. It will be 28 pound with the discount, but I love it and it actually matches my nail polish I'm wearing at the moment, which is Smith & Colt 
in Feed the Rich. It just matches it so well. I'm just very much into this green emerald thing and I think this will be a very nice outfit finisher offer for the winter season. Now the other two things I got off ASOS were Whistles coats. I got them off ASOS just because I find that delivery is quicker and the returns process is nice and easy and I've actually looked online and these don't seem to be online in ASOS or at Whistles but I have found them in like John Lewis and House of Rage and all stuff like that so there will be links down below for them. And they were kind of pricey but I really feel that the places to invest are in shoes, handbags and coats. You could literally wear a bin bag under all of those and still look incredible so I quite like investing in coats because they're something that I do tend to not fall out of love with as much as things like tops and jeans and that kind of thing. I really like a pea coat cut, I just find that it flatters my figure quite well, that it's good for my height, they don't come up too short, they're not too long, they're kind of just somewhere in the middle and this is like a pea coat cut but again with like the coloured faux fur, this is the thing I can't, I'm really having a thing with coloured faux fur and this is a black pea coat, I think it's called their Erica coat but then it's got this royal blue fur collar and I just think it's beautiful. I feel like this coat just fits like a glove. I can't remember what size I got. I think I got, is it coming a 10? Got it in a UK size 10. It's perfect. It's not too short in the arm. It's just, it just fits really well. I could fit something quite chunky under this but it's also not too oversized that if I'm just wearing like a light jumper or something that it's too big. I'm just very, very chuffed with this and I love that the fur is detachable because when it's raining, you get inside and this just looks raggedy if you've got it in the rain. I just feel like it's a very thick, practical coat that my mum would be proud of me for buying. However, <laughs> this one I think she'll be even more impressed with slash want to nick it off of me when I show her because I actually think she has a coat like this. This is a Whistles Parker jacket and I've wanted a Whistles Parker jacket again for years. I feel like they do the best Parker jackets in that they're like a little bit fitted but a little bit oversized and they're very practical. They're always so thick, have amazing linings in and this one is no exception. It's beautiful. I think it's called their like waxy Parker jacket or something. I'll try and find some links for you and pop it down below but the fake fur in this is insane. It's not only round the hood, it goes all the way down the coat. Again, this whole bit is detachable, which again, I just really like. I think that's very practical. But then even if you detach that, the lining, like I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this, but it's like a fluffy fleece. Like I want this in blanket form. Picked it up in a small, there you go. And I just love this. It's very practical. It's got your pockets on. It's gonna be great for like brunch, weekend slash general errand running and yeah like I said my mum is definitely going to want to pick this off of me. So that's everything from ASOS like I mentioned 20% off great news all the links will be down below but then there are a couple of things I picked up from and other stories and I just find that and other stories are like bringing it like I go on their website and I basically want everything. Everything's very monochrome, it's very simple, it's a bit like cost but less baggy <laughs> and also really reasonably priced and I don't know what their code is or if they're having a Black Friday anything. I have a feeling they've got like 50% off of selected lines so I don't know if that's going to be anything that I actually picked out but I will link it down below for you, I'll let you know. But there are three things I picked up and they're all tops because I just find that their tops are really nice, like you guys would have seen me wear my navy thick, I think it's called like an oversized wool texture jumper or something. I've been wearing that a ton. I always get questions on it whenever I'm wearing it. I think it's like £35, absolute bargain, completely worn it to death. But it is quite thick and sometimes I want something a little bit thinner but I love the colour navy. I just think it's one of my favourite colours. It's up there with black. You know me, you know me. So I actually picked up this top that I'm wearing now and it is 100% cashmere and it's £95 which is super pricey for a jumper but actually for something that's 100% cashmere is quite reasonable and I find that the cut of it is lovely. It's got some ribbing on the cuffs here and also some ribbing on the hem down below and it's very thin and I like that because it's very good for like tuck it into the front of your jeans or something like that. It's like a little bit dressier than a normal jumper because it is slightly form fitting. It's quite a slim fit, it's not oversized or anything like that. They have it in a ton of colours which is very dangerous indeed but I'm just so happy with the quality of their knitwear. It washes really well and I just lo I love it. I'm really, really, really happy with this purchase. I feel like I'm going to get 
a lot of wear out of this. So if you're tempted to make a cashmere purchase, I would highly recommend them and like point you in their direction because honestly, amazing. Also really fast delivery as well, like no problems with shopping on their website, which is great news. Then I picked up two kind of shirt blouses because I feel like their blouses on there are really beautiful. They're like very plain, but then there's always a little twist going on. There's like a little frill or a little bit of texture and I like that, it's something a bit different. And the first one that I picked up is this. It's kind of creamy, it's an off-white and it's like this Victoriana type blouse and it's got this frilly v-neck detail going on and I've seen loads of these I think on the Topshop website love them but they all had like crazy backs going on this is just a very simple shirt it's quite a long line shirt so it kind of covers your bum although you can tuck it in it works really nice and tucked in and it looks really cool kind of left slightly open but also done up all the way to the top as well and I just feel like this is a top that I could wear for like evenings out wear on like Christmas day it's like a slightly fancier top for when I want to look a little bit more formal but really happy with that I picked that up in a size 38 I think I pick up everything in a size 38 on their website and it always fits and I'm always happy there sizing is very consistent and then this one I was eyeing up for the longest time it looked incredible on the model I think they call it their floose blouse or something floose bluse something like that I was eyeing it up for the longest time and it kept coming in and out of stock and I was like right I just need to make my move next time it's in stock and it's just got a three quarter length sleeve, it's kind of mid length so it works really well for tucking, it's not cropped, it's not too long and I think this looks cooler with a slightly open neckline but you could button it up all the way to the top and again it's just got these like little frills, there's some frills on the shoulders, there's a frill around the collar and it's just very pretty, really simple, I mean check it out on the website, you will see it on the model and be like yes I need that in my life. <laughs> then there is one more thing that I have to show you and actually I purchased this a couple of months ago now, I picked it up, my god it was a really long time ago because I picked it up and I thought I might wear it to Lily's wedding, I actually ended up wearing something different to her wedding and I wore this to my friend's wedding recently because I was only going to the reception and it was like a winter wedding so I felt it was more appropriate <laughs> to wear an all black outfit. And you know me, I own a lot of jumpsuits. For me, I'm not really a dress kind of gal. There's just something about it. I think because it's black and it's got like a cold shoulder detail, it is perfect. It's from Whistles. It's called their Mia Frill jumpsuit, I think. It's like a three quarter length culotte type bottom. So there's this wide leg bottom going on. And I like that it hasn't got too much leg going out because it means you only need to like fake tan your ankles, which is great. And then it's got this like cut out detail on the back, which is really pretty and it's got these like frilly cold shoulder thing kind of going on but I'm just so chuffed with this purchase I feel like you can't go wrong with like a black jumpsuit it'll sort you out for like any formal occasion because you're never going to look too dressy or too underdressed in something like this so that's it if you can't tell I'm really happy with everything that I picked up I'm like literally just babbling away because I'm so happy with everything and like I mentioned all of the discounts and links and everything you need will be down in the description box below I will also link my how to make a capsule wardrobe video for you here along with my latest video which was a how I stay organized and like general life organization tips and I have done a post all about the best Black Friday deals I will link that for you here along with the subscribe button so if you haven't done that it's much appreciated thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon bye